Welcome back to another, it's me Cam from Cam's Club and welcome back to another daily Chelsea transfer news video where today I'll be talking more about Moises Casado, Chelsea's new midfielder signing, Eli Wahill, Conor Gallagher and all things Chelsea so if you're new I'm Cam from Cam's Club and I do daily Chelsea transfer news videos I'm trying to get to a thousand subs very soon so if you could like and subscribe that would help me a lot but without further ado let's get in the first story. Now of course starting off where I left last video and that's talking about Moises Casado I'm going to go to Gary Jacob who has said Brighton's hard stance is a source of growing frustration for Moises Casado, and this is following the news that Chelsea's fifth and final bid for Moises Casado is coming very soon. Will that be the £100 million? Will that be 90 Will it be 85 Well, we don't know. Brighton swiftly rejected the £80 million bid two days ago, so will Chelsea be going up to 100 mil? We're not too sure. However, Chelsea have looked around at people like Lavia as replacements and Chelsea have signed a midfielder which I'll be talking about later but carry on by saying Moise Casado and his representatives will seek further talks with Brighton and Hove Albion to try and persuade the club to bring their asking price down from 100 million. Casado and his representatives are keen to handle the matter sensitively out of respect for Brighton. Yeah this is good from Casado he's trying to push a move and make Brighton really not keep the money at 100 million because we all know that's probably not going to happen. Brian are harsh negotiators. What they want is usually what they get, as we see. £62 million for Cucurella, £50 million for Ben White, stuff like that. We're keeping Levi Curl, so hopefully he's not going to be you know, in the negotiations. I, don't, I doubt he will. But with Moises Casado pushing for this deal, it's looking like it's a bit more likely to happen, but not for 100 mil. I'm not too sure. Well, I'm pretty sure bid from Chelsea, 85 to 90, will be the last one because we don't want to be mucked around by that but let me know if you want my Casado but on to the next story <coughs> and the main news story today is that Chelsea are signed a 19 year old French midfielder by the name of Leslie I'm gonna just call him Leslie but without further ado going to Fabrizio Romano who said Chelsea have sealed the agreement to sign 2004 talent Leslie Okochwu 27 to 80, 28 million euros fee agreed with Ren medical test already booked a long-term deal also agreed loan to Strasbourg or staying at Chelsea decision to be made soon also with Pochettino here we go we got the here we go from Fabrizio Romano it is done same age as me just a bit smaller at 6'2 what can I say but Fabrizio Romano goes on by saying Leslie Okochwu set to be excluded by Ren squad for a friendly game versus West Ham later today he's on the verge of joining Chelsea deal will be completed in the next hours club and players don't want to take any risks well yeah don't want him to get injured of course the game time would be good but the main thing is 23 million pounds for young talent he was on the radar for Brighton going to be the Moises Casello backup we know how Brighton are with scouting so it's good that we're taking a scouting approach to signing these players people like Nicholas Jackson and Malagusto we're not breaking the bank they're solid uh, investments really we're not having to spend the 50 million for Lavia I'm going to bring up the stats here and they're pretty much exactly the same with Roman Lavia. Lavia, of course, is the Premier League experience, but as you can tell, same stats for £20 million. Less, of course, he's not Premier League proven. He's still same same age as Lavia, just a bit younger. But also, we're talking about loaning him to Strasbourg, of course, Chelsea's second team, really. There's lots of memes about Comet and Chelsea being in the Champions League next season, which would be great. One French player to another. Talks are progressing well on Chelsea signing Montpellier striker Eli Wahir. In depth and lots of other videos, but all you need to know, 23 years of age, scored 19 goals in Ligue 1 last season. Of course, looks like he's going to be joining Strasbourg. Strasbourg going to be building quite a strong team, but just ending today off with Conor Gallagher. Looks like he's going to be extending his contract, but can still be up to sale. I was talking about yesterday, £15 million pounds looks like going to be around the mark that we're willing to sell him for. Of course, West Ham are out the deal after you know we rejected a 47 million pound bid very very annoying and tomorrow i'll be talking about ryan Sharkey and michael lise because they look like they're going to be the attacking players that we want to sign but of course nathan gizzing has to put a stamp in that by saying ryan Sharkey to chelsea is not happening but we will see we will see because chelsea of course right now we've been focusing on Casado for so long it's nice to out the blue sign this leslie fella uh, homework for you lot is watch some comps I'll show you the stats but yeah 19 years of age quite tall ta stature and similar stats to Lavia so for much cheaper probably good scouting but done by Chelsea which is different because usually we spend the most money on stupid players like Cucurella but yeah thank you guys for watching I'll see you tomorrow for more Chelsea transfer news videos see you then